Right guys, welcome to episode three of Gorilla Cocktails. We're right here in the heart of where? Covent Garden. The sun is shining and I'm excited about today's episode. We're coming home to one of the most iconic parts of the London bar scene. Home to the Roadhouse, Navajo Joe's, Pacifico, La Perla. This is one of my favorite parts of London. Why is it so special? It's Mother's Day and I've got my mum in town. So let's go and meet her and get a few words about what it's like growing up with a bartender in the family. When he first took an interest in cocktails was after watching the movie Cocktail. Uh, he was about 16 years old. He met a boy called James Hopkins who had come to the school at Worcester from Australia. He was into his cocktails and between them, they uh, used to practice a lot upstairs in our house. A lot of banging on the floor when the bottles dropped. Hey babe. Oh my God. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Oh, my love. I got you a little present. I asked, uh, I asked Frankie to go and pick you something special out. Oh, something you, did, you didn't I... get it yourself then? Oh, James. <laughs> what is it? What is it, Mum? It's an edible G-string. Oh, you've always wanted one of them, haven't you? Yeah? <laughs> Right, so um, our friends at Moe and Chandon are coming down. I'm going to be treating you to a uh, champagne tasting, at which point we're then going to go into the street's blood of Covent Garden and we're going to see whose Bellini everyone loves the most. I'm making one and you're making one. I'll give you a little hand. How many bubbles do you think are in here right now? None. Absolutely none, exactly. <laughs> so many people tell me, millions, millions. Bang out, well done. Can't pull them all of you. Because it doesn't actually have any bubbles until the reaction with the um, oxygen. Yeah. So, yeah. Don't forget to pick up a bottle of wine for your mum for Mother's Day. After all, you're one of the reasons why you should drink. <laughs> Cheers to you, babe. Thank you so much for everything. Cheers. Mom, Cheers. Please stick around for our cocktail challenge. We need a little bit of help, I think. We're going to make some drinks. You enjoy. Stick around. You be in better behaviour. <laughs> Let's do it. Mum, I love your drink, but I think this is one of my favourite star bellinis of all time. This is a twist on the drink by Naren Young, who is my favourite bartender of all time. Um, he's based over in New York. Close to divine, know the moment is mine, need a omen or sign. Providing a back sound to all the squares that ask around, we getting it. My skills pay me, trying to get a million baby with an adopted flow that God gave me. Me now. Right, Mum and I both love the cocktails, but it's not for us to decide. It is the people of Covent Garden. So we're going to mix up some samples, go outside, and we're going to get a vote cast on the streets. Ready? Perfect. Yes, I'm ready. Right, let's do this. I hope you're ready. I'm ready. The results are now in. You have been a special mother. Thank you very much for coming down. Pleasure. Did you have fun? I did. I yeah. did, yeah. Lucy kindly nominated herself to pop the losing balloon. I'm the winner. It's fixed. It's rigged. <laughs> I taught you everything you know, honey. <laughs> right. Big thanks to Lucy, ish. Big thanks to you, ma'am. Big thanks to you guys for tuning in. Remember, if you like the vid, share them. If you like the cocktails, mix them. Either way, share the page. Next round's on you. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>